And, and the great thing about dunes is that they're naturally self-repairing. So you get a period of erosion where the dune erodes quite severely. There's lots of plants that will stop dunes from being eroded by the wind, but there's only two native plants that will actually rebuild your dune, and one of those is spinifex, that's the most common, and then penile. And so we've come up with a technique called push-ups, where basically it's dune restoration. We do what nature does. Nature when it's repairing a dune, the wind blows sand from the, the beach into the dune, the plants trap it, and they rebuild the dune. So we bring in bulldozers, and, and we do what the wind does, and we push up the dune. And so after severe events like Cyclone Gabriel, we can basically reinstate the dune, sometimes even bigger than what was there before the storm. Okay. And we usually design that, that dune to at least be more than adequate for one big storm, sometimes more yeah. than that. And so basically you can uh, reduce the risk substantially. Yeah. And that buy, That's a, not a long-term solution, but it buys the owner's time. That means they don't have to relocate immediately. It gives yeah. us time to plan for the next steps and, if, yeah. and, and work and, with the and community. Owners have, and, yeah, and owners have different situations. Some people will say, look, okay, I'm going to relocate the house. Uh, but other people say, no, I'm not really in a position where I want to replace that just yet. And so you can buy 10, 15, 20, sometimes longer years using this particular technique. It's not a long long-term solution, but it buys time for some of those longer-term solutions like setbacks to take effect.